So we've done our first pass, uh, and you can see that there's some mild erythema on the skin, but there's not enough else to see, and that's completely what we want. For the second pass, I'm going to use a 590 cutoff filter. So this is a really similar uh, wavelength to most of the vascular lasers. So the original pulse dye laser will be around a 585 nanometer laser. And you can see as opposed to a red light, this is a yellow light. So the main chromophore here is absolutely 100% going to be the hemoglobin. Again, when I'm treating for flushing and redness, I tend to split my pulse in three. Um, and what we're going to do in the, in the next shot is actually we're going to slow it down. At least my cameraman's going to slow it down. So hopefully you'll be able to see those three individual pulses firing. But the patient will only experience it at the single shot.